Once Upon a Time by Gabriel Okara Poem Video Summary Poem Introduction Once Upon a Time by Gabriel Okara reflects changes made in social behaviors and culture along with loss of innocence. The speaker is the poet, represents the old generation, he speaks to his son, a child, represents the young generation. He expresses how people were once, how they are now, how he also changed his nature in order to survive and how he wishes to get back to his old him. Poem Summary In the first two stanzas, the poet says to his son how they, i.e., himself and people, used to be. They used to laugh out loud through their hearts and eyes with joyful tears but nowadays they use teeth to laugh along with their tearless cold eyes searching all through his shadow to violate his privacy. People used to shake hands with love and nowadays they shake to investigate his pockets. Feel at home. Come again were once the welcoming and bye biting phrases but nowadays there is only a twice and no thrice. People shut doors at him if he tries to feel at home more than twice. In the third and fourth stanzas, he tells his son about the lessons he learned from modern society. He says he learned to wear a variety of masks in public according to the occasion like home face, office face, host face, cocktail face, etc. All with a portrait perfect smile. He says he has also learned to laugh like them through teeth. He learned to say goodbye even if it is a good riddance in the heart. He learned to shake hands without love and to say glad to meet you even if he did not feel glad. Also, he learned to say it's nice talking to you though it is boring. In the last two stanzas, the poet reports his regret and wishes to his son. He asks his son to believe that he wishes to get back to what he was once. He wishes to unlearn everything that he has grown to be because he regrets being this, a fake person. He also wishes to laugh out loud as if his teeth appear like snake fangs and smile through his heart to enjoy with pleasure like he used to do once upon a time. Finally, he begs his son to teach him to be innocent like was back then as a child. Thanks for watching. If you liked our video, please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Click the links below to follow us across other social media platforms and our website where you can read many such easy summaries of English literature. www.literpretation.com